Hi and welcome students. In this video I'll be covering PowerPoint 2016 and I'm going to show you how to move or copy text. Let's get started. So you'll see that on this slide here it's discussing youth athletic programs that we have available and so the first thing that I want to teach you how to do is select text in PowerPoint and if I click within the uh, placeholder I could double click a word to select the word or triple click a word to select the entire paragraph. To copy it you could either go to the home tab clipboard group and click this copy button or you could do a control C on your keyboard. Alright so after you hit control C it's now copied to what's called the clipboard and what the clipboard does is it holds everything that you've copied until you decide to paste it and so when you copy and paste something it's equivalent to duplicating something so if I want to put it say on the next slide I click the next slide and I can click right here to add text and then I need to paste it alright to paste you have a couple options you could go to the home tab clipboard group or and you can click on paste or you can click this drop down arrow and choose a paste option and so I'm gonna show you the first one which is clicking on paste it also says you could you can do control V as in Victor they do the same thing and there we go it pasted it onto the page or you could go right down here and click these paste options and see what it would look like if you were to keep the source formatting put it in as a picture or keep the text only this keep text only is something that I do want to discuss if you were taking a um, piece of text from let's say an internet source and you wanted to copy and paste it onto your document keep text only is a pretty good one or uh, using the destination theme is a good one that way it doesn't keep the theme from the original source which is uh, this second option right here and again when you're creating a PowerPoint presentation you want everything to look pretty similar in terms of your themes and your formatting so there we go that's how we copy and paste now the next thing that I'm going to show you how to do is move text and let's say that we wanted to move uh, soccer up on this list and so the way that we do that is if you have a bulleted list you can click and drag on the bullet to actually move it up within the list okay so we'll move it up there now again another way to move text is by double clicking it or triple clicking it and then moving it around and so if I put basketball right before soccer you'll see that unfortunately when you do that it doesn't quite work as well you have to then click uh, after uh, basketball and before soccer and then press enter and it even creates an extra problem down here with having to delete that extra space so again for moving bullets I do recommend using this four directional arrow the last thing that we're going to do is a cut and paste and so to cut and paste you'll choose whatever selection that you want in this case I'm going to choose all four of these and let's say that I don't want these on this slide anymore I'd rather put them on the next slide well cut and paste whereas copy and paste makes a duplicate cut and paste does not cut and paste what it does is it moves it entirely so once I move it from here it'll go to the clipboard once I move it off of the clipboard it'll be gone from here forever all right so here we go cut and paste is home tab clipboard group and it's this button right here cut and so it'll remove it from there and then I can go to the next one and the shortcut for cut is control X on your keyboard as in x-ray and then I can choose the spot that I want to paste it I'm gonna just hit the next paragraph press tab and then control V okay and control V again is paste so there we go now it's been pasted in and so again you can choose your paste options but this looks fine to me alright so hopefully this video has taught you a little bit more about cut and paste copy and paste as well as moving your text around and moving your bullets if it has helped you at all please give it a thumbs up and consider subscri subscribing to the channel thank you so much and or thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day bye